A 2021 poll discovered a nearly half million rise among vegans in only one year. Veganism is clearly more than a trend. But one fundamental issue remains. Is it healthy? Here are seven reasons why many experts have a legit beef with vegans. Number 1. Vegans fart more. People who eat a completely plant-based diet are particularly flatulent. According to a new research, vegan guys fart up to seven times more than their omnivore counterparts. Number 2. Leaky gut syndrome. The problem is that the proteins found in legumes include considerable levels of lectins and phytates, two chemicals known as anti-nutrients, because they can hinder the absorption of genuine nutrients such as vitamins and minerals. This failure to absorb nutrients adequately causes intestinal permeability, which is the medical term for leaky gut syndrome. Anti-nutrient buildup damages the lining of the small intestine. The increased permeability of the lining allows undigested food particles, germs, and other poisons to seep through the gut walls and into the circulation over time. Number 3. Anemia due to a lack of iron. Vegans and vegetarians are both at a greatly increased risk of anemia, which is described as a lack of healthy red blood cells to transport enough oxygen to the body's tissues. Iron deficient anemia, the most frequent kind of anemia worldwide, is partly due to growing vegetarianism and veganism. Red meat has long been the most readily available source of iron for human bodies to create hemoglobin, the iron-rich protein found in red blood cells. Non-meat eaters must find other sources of this nutrition, as they must for a variety of other animal-based elements. Number 4. B12 Deficiency. Vitamin B12 is only found naturally in meat, fish, and some animal-based meals. While vegetarians can acquire a good quantity of this crucial mineral by eating eggs, vegans are out of luck. Instead, individuals must rely on synthetic sources of B12, such as pills or chemically fortified dietary products like grain cereals and non-dairy milk substitutes. Number 5. Veganism and Eating Disorders. Orthorexia is a form of eating disorder characterized by an excessive focus on healthy eating habits. It can lead to over-restriction, preoccupation, and other potentially harmful attitudes regarding food and nutrition. Most eating disorder experts do not advise persons seeking to recover from eating disorders such as orthorexia or anorexia to follow restricted diets such as veganism or vegetarianism. Number 6. Vegans overweight. Vegans' dietary constraints not only make it difficult to get enough protein and micronutrients. However, there is a risk of ingesting too much of certain foods. Carbohydrates are the most important of these dietary groups. One of the issues here is a complication caused by the principal protein sources of many vegans. Because legumes frequently replace meats, eggs, and dairy products as protein sources, vegans face the accompanying disadvantage of this lentil and bean-eating bonanza. Legumes are extremely rich in carbohydrates. Many vegan alternatives, quinoa beans, and lentils, have more carbs than protein. Number 7. Substitutes for meat. Many vegans have chosen a clean diet that contains copious amounts of not-so-clean substances. Plant-based meat replacements are an excellent illustration of trade. Grade a meat for grade a nonsense. Impossible burgers, for example, are loaded with synthetic, distasteful chemicals to help replicate the flavor and feel of genuine meat. Thank you for watching. If you like this video don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give me a big thumbs up, and hit the notifications button to receive all our new videos.